it is what it do what it be. You know who it is. Oh, I'm getting so sick and tired of this coronavirus that you guys are calling, acting like it's the end of the world. Even the symptoms are just a flu-like symptoms. You might as we might as all well just have the coronavirus and then get over it. Feel bad for a couple of days, maybe two weeks. Get over it. Come on, guys. I've had the flu. Two days later, I was not back to normal, but about a month later, you know, I could have, I got out of bed after the two days and then like that first week or so, you're out doing stuff, but um, within three days, but like a month really to really recover. But I mean, you can still go on. Um, you guys are, and then people were talking about it and all this, this is, this guys are, people are acting so stupid. You guys are acting like a bunch of morons. People fighting in the grocery stores and acting like they're, you know, if you guys are so, let me tell you this, and I'll tell you this right now, and this is a warning for people in, in that have, that are, that are taking this coronavirus to the extent you guys that are fighting in the grocery stores, you guys are getting mad. You guys are panicking. You guys are saying, oh my goodness, I tried to order off of this website and it took two days for my order to come. You guys, you need to get your ass up, right? Walk, get in your car or whatever you have. Go to the grocery store, pick out what you need and then take it home. And if you guys, you know, maybe you guys don't understand, but you can live without food for 30 days. So all you really need is some water and just keep that around. And you should already, if you're so smart, you should have had that. You should have had bottled water and other things in your house already in your home because you never know when you might need it. And this whole thing about you guys fighting in the stores, you guys will be the first ones to die. I guarantee you that. Because if you're fighting for that stuff, and we're talking about it really gets serious, you guys think that you're going to be safe in your home? People will start going crazy, breaking in your homes, grabbing your stuff, and you guys are acting so good. What are you guys going to do? Nothing. You're either going to give it to them or you have to. And another thing with that is like... You guys, let's believe it. Half of you guys in America need to lose weight anyway. Let's 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 be honest with that. Thirty days of no food, even half that might do good for your health overall. Half Americans would be looking a lot better. Let's let's say that it will be a lot healthier. Let's just say that. So, and besides that, you guys will be the first ones to die fighting in the stores. You guys, if you can't survive now, and you're already freaking out. If, if something does happen and it starts to spread and it gets pretty uh, intense and millions of people start catching that, you guys will be the first ones to die. I guarantee you that.